Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Warhammer Mark of Chaos with me, Grey Hunter, where we finally got access to a town. Hooray! So what are we going to do here? Well, I don't know yet. Let's see what we can buy. Get some pistoliers if we wanted them. But it doesn't really seem all that useful at the moment. So he said he was taking some of our men, but he didn't actually take any of our men. At least I don't think he did, so that's good. Um, there's no point getting that. Let's see, can the elves get anything? They can make camp. Can they advance to here? Uh, they can. They can enter the town. But they can't get any heroes or anything like that. The only thing they can get is replenishment on their troops, but that's okay. That's fine. That's good, actually. So, go to the temple for replacements, full replacements, and full replacements. Cool. So, what happens in the third, in the uh, next mission, I'm pretty sure that there's only the one left, is that you fight a siege defense. And you can use units from both armies. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade all of the units that are tier 3. With all the remaining upgrades that they haven't already got. For both armies. And everybody is going to get a horse. I probably won't use horses for all that many of them. But horses are very, very, very handy. Uh, Gunther, yes, you can have a horse. You can't have a horse, apparently. But that's okay. You don't need one. Elector Count. Stefan von Kessel does, though. Well, I guess he's technically not the Elector Count at the moment. But he might as well be. Ooh, no, I don't want that. I want this. There we go. And you, Gunther. You've got two points. Do it. Very nice, and you've got one. Do it. Okay, so you've got all yours. You've got all yours. You're still not level three, but we'll probably take you anyway, because you are very good. Done, done. Done, done, done. You guys already have stuff. You don't. I'm debating whether or not to bring you. You are all leveled up. You're all leveled up. Hellblaster could be very, very good. But I don't know how many war machines we're allowed to take, so I guess we will figure that out later. Alrighty, items. Any items that are particularly cool. That could be very good. I'm going to get that for Gunther. Hero is not mounted, but he can be. So, yeah, he won't be though. Um, hmm. We still can't get him a cool hammer. I want to get him an awesome hammer, but it cannot be so. You're all set. You could do with another ring, but we don't really have one for you to get. We don't need that, so you can get rid of that. Um. We'll keep these things, because I think we might maybe be able to swap them between <clears throat> uh, each army. I still don't know where this goes, though. Maybe it does just sit in your backpack and you're all set. I don't know. I would have thought it would be one of these, but maybe not. The Blade of Leaping Gold. Might have to buy that for one of the elves. So yes, at the, at the beginning here, it's going to be a lot of just uh, fiddling about. Oh, no, that's, that's not as nearly as good as the one we've got. Um, no, she doesn't need any of that stuff. She could use that, though. Yeah, because we've already got a guy who does plus 400 to the mana pool on our side, so that's handy. She can use that sword. And she will be mounted. 
when we take her into combat. And we'll definitely we'll be taking the Great Eagle for definite. But I think that's just about it in terms of preparations, because really there's not much point getting anything else. Buy a blessing for everybody who's level three. Blessing, because really, what are we going to spend the money on otherwise? There is no like second campaign or anything like that, so there's no point. Uh, you be blessed. You can be blessed. These guys get a blessing. Nope. Oops. And the temple. Bless. Bless. Be blessed, our sons. Be blessed. We probably won't take the knights because it'll be a defensive fight. And there probably won't be much cause for them. I can't remember if there is any actual use for them in this next set of missions. So let's go to the outskirts. Is Aurelian not coming? Maybe she just sort of teleports in. If, as the great crater wall of Talibium rises above the horizon, the army quickens its pace, etc., etc. Of gods and demons, the battle for Talibium. Dun, dun, dun. The greatest battle of the war is about to begin. The defense of Talibium are strong, but if the city is to stand against the on Coming onslaught, every man and elf must do his best. Damn straight. So yeah, you get to choose other guys. You can only take four heroes, and that commander is pretty much useless to us. Like, he, he's good, but he's not really all that handy. Can he give these? No, he can't give that to anybody. He can give this to somebody, though. Is anyone not wearing an amulet? She's not. Perfect. Yeah, have that. Uh, you've got the plus mana thing that you can... She gives this to you? No. He's all set. Have you got any rings that you don't need? No. Have you got a ring? No. Have you got a ring? No. Okay, so we can take many, many units. We'll want both of our veteran handgunners. Uh, we'll take the eagle, obviously. We can take four siege weapons. You, 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 and the Hellblaster, I should think. Now we want some rock hard troops. So we'll need you. And the Swordmasters could be useful. But I think we'll take the two veteran archers in preference to them. Some swordsmen and some spearmen. And yeah, you guys. So what do we got? One, two, three, four, five. Five units of proper infantry, four units of archers, the eagle, and some guns. I like it. Alright, so I'll pause the recording here and I will see you on the battle map. Okay, so we can deploy out here, which is what we're going to do, but first we're going to organize people. So, Stefan, you're going to go with the Halberdiers. Death does not matter. Gunther with them. The winds of Gairam can heal you're going with the handgunning unit as per I'm usual, and you endeavors. cannot really join a unit, but that's okay. Fight with pride, fight with courage! So what we're going to do is we're going to form a first line with these fellas. Pray to Sigma. Going to put a cannon over Get here wheels rolling. There and is no the escape bolt from thrower. The, claw. Pray to Sigma. the other cannon will go here push boys, push. and the hell blaster will go they here and move up with the point. troops. So is there a way around? No. They have to come across this narrow choke point, which is perfect for us. Okay, so that's group number one. Are we yours shall to not command. take a step back. 
Mighty Sigmar looks upon us all. You two are reserve I units. The will of Sigmar. To be thrown in at the second when we need to hold. No evil and cannot fail. Bloodshed. I yearn to kill Ready the Emperor's foes. You guys group two. You the guys group four. With the gift of life I comes Let the our arrows find Emperor's their mark. Well. Moving on at once. Uh, Eagle. Hang out over here. And Aurelian, you're going to be playing run around a lot. So if needed, we can fall back to this altar of vitality, but our objective, I believe, is to keep all keep at least one house remaining. So let's have a look. Now is the time of our judgment. Yes. The whole of the Empire looks upon this day. And should we fail, there will be no I history to record our defeat. This is where we make our stand and prove the worth of the fight. men of the Empire. Our bows fight to the death and fight for Both Sigma! Okay, Eagle. For Advance. seven thousand years, we have fought against the Dark Gods. It will not be here on this distant field that our strength finally fails. Here we will triumph. And you shall all be remembered alongside the greatest warriors of our people! Destroy the darkness! Alright, Eagle, where are ya? Go take that thing out. Marauders, marauder axe throwers, that's fine. Go take out the hell cannon. Alright, and you, you... Hell blast a volley gun. Of you go over fight these here. We'll be more effective from over there. I should hope so. Whoa. Wait, are you no, you're not my guys. That's fine. Come on, destroy that gun. Destroy that gun. Or just keep it busy, actually. It doesn't really matter. As long as it's not attacking me, I'm happy. Okay, clunk. It's fine. Run! The beast will devour us all! Hopefully not. That would be most displeasing. So we'll move group one up here. The wind of Gyran grants us all life. The Empire will not fall without a we fight. We will bring victory. We shall take up a new position. There we go. That should leave space for the Hell Blaster. Swell. Come on, Eagle. Take this thing down. Need to fire. Ooh. Come on, you need to fire on it. You need to fire on them. Do it. Alright, go there. Powder packed in. The eagle's claw always finds its mark. If we lose the eagle, that will not be a good thing. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Even if we do lose the eagle, we'll survive. Never again shall chaos topple the greatest of all ones. For Magnus and the Empire! Yeah, it'll be fine. What is your command, General? Go help out. The darkness shall Step not defeat us. us! What is your command, General? Kill them all! That's the command. Actually. Alright, Aurelian, go help out. Eagle, go over here. No! Alright, Aurelian. I wield the power of the white. Go kill these fools. No! No mad can fight these creatures! Kill that. Aurelian, go! Nice. Alright. You guys. Move up. 
Chaos must be resisted at every turn. And Stefan. Help him out. March forward. Awesome. So yeah, our allies will lose a lot of men, but I don't care. Not our problem. No, attack it. Come on, you have to stop it from shooting, not let it shoot. Does not win wars. There you go. Oh, fudge balls. All right, she's alive. That's fine. This foe is beyond us. Nah. Brave Just you. Sigma. Get those dragons. No armor can withstand these bolts. So yeah, there's a lot of dudes coming straight for us. But that's all right. The strength of Ulf One is in us. Sigma for the glory the of Ulf One. The gods have abandoned us. The darkness shall Mighty not prevail. Sigma looks upon us all. Ah. Seriously? What are you doing? No, I do that. The greatest of all one, hear your call. The gods have abandoned None know us. the true destination. Haha. -ha. The winds of magic guide me. Uh oh. Run away. <laughs> the road winds much, Go back over there. But leads ever onwards. There you go. See, you can do it. Ah, eagle. Flee. Uh actually, Eagle. Come back here. Go fly, fly, my pretty. Our bows are ready. Right. I feel the power of the earth beneath us. You might want to stand a bit further away, General. <laughs> okay. So we don't actually have to do anything in a set amount of time. We just have to hold out. No man can fight these and at some point, the bad guy who is and a demon prince will show up. So we'll move these up. Just so they're not stuck all the way back out of the way where they can't do anything. Bang, bang, bang. This is the pride of the College of Engineers. Our arrows glance go swiftly justice. and surely. The gods have abandoned us! Never again shall chaos topple the greatest of all one. Hooray! Excellent. The gods have guided me to your side. So, if you've made it through to this last battle, generally it's not all that difficult to win. The thing that is a problem. Halt. We await your is changing position. Basically, just how many men there are, how many enemies. So counter charge them please. You attack them. Hello, Furies. How you doing? How you doing? Our aim is true. You guys, I need you to shoot at these Furies. Yes, quite likely. We await you. Stop moving. Just keep doing your thing. Kill it, kill it, kill it. The purest magic is mine to command. Yeah, they got it down. They're doing fine. And fall back. Come on, fall back already. 
I am eager to assist your endeavors. Run! The beast will devour us all! The doom of the world may not yet come to pass. And stop them. Come on, Stefan, do your thing. No. There you go. Yes, hello, Hell Cannon. We see you. Actually, no, don't. There we go. Charge them. Actually, you know, don't. Actually, on second thoughts, because there's a unit of Knights of Nurgle coming towards us, and that would not be friendly. I carry the ancient wisdom. Let's just slow them down when they come to attack us. Your soldiers are ready, my lord. So what do we got? Lots and lots and lots of guys. That's okay. We can deal with that. Our you should advance. Fly true. Where's that other hell cannon? Hey, Eagle, I have a new job for you. Really, Swordmasters? Within all mortals. Really? You think yourself safe from harm? You will learn that mere stone cannot hide you from the wrath of the gods. Maybe not. But that's okay, because that's not what we're hiding from. And halt. The and halt. Curse Blatt. Curse Blatt again. Oh, what's that? Those are guns. Yes, they are. And they hurt, don't they? Yeah, they do. Whoa, no. Fire that. Hello. Kill them, please. Kaboom! As the gods decree. Oh hell no, you don't. Stop. Stop. We shall strike them down Stop. from afar. This is the pride of the College of Engineers. Alright, now Eagle, what you doing? Attack that. Charge them. The wrath of Sigmar will be swift. The gods have abandoned us. Frenemy cannon, please stop shooting at where my guys are. No man can fight these creatures. Alright, fall back. Kill them all! Ha ha ha! How do you like them apples? No man you can might want to stand creatures. a bit further away, General. Right, Keep now you can eye. shoot at will again. The eagle's claw no is man ready, can Commander. Fight these creatures. The Empire will not fall without a fight. Yes, now you can shoot at will again. All right, Eagle, where did you go? Get over there. Cannon ready, my lord. We await your orders. Hello. All right, Eagle. Can you just uh, fly over there and take out that cannon for me, please? Would be greatly appreciated. Death for glory. Yes, yes. Kill it. Alright, what do we got? We got axe throwers, warriors. More warriors, that's fine. Stop them. No man can fight these creatures! Mighty Sigma looks upon us. United we get Sigma, grant me you strength. Might want to stand a bit further away, Jack. Charge! The beast will devour us all! The wind will guide and branch us all. You might want to stand a bit further away, General. Kill them all. 
There we go. Ah, uh, smite them. We await your command. For the glory of the Empire Oak One. will not fall without a fight. Leave nothing but corpses for the crow! Mind to death. We cannot fail. All loaded. Stop. Name your target, Stop. Commander. The winds of Gyran can the heal the bloodiest wound. There we go. And cannon, yeah. Your orders, Commander. No man can fight these creatures! Death does not matter. Come on, kill him. I really wish our friend and me cannon would stop shooting. Because, you know, we've got dudes in there. Dudes fighting to help him. Oh, hello. They do, do they? Well, that ought to be interesting. So, what happens is Thor... Thorgar the Blooded One is invisible. Our bolts shall fly true. Very well, but we can see we him. Maybe it's just that we know where he is, but we can't actually shoot him yet. There is steel in our arms and fire we await in your our castle. No, apparently we just can't see him. Range on that target. He's invisible. He's also stopped. Loaded and eager, my lord. Ready and willing. I can live with that. So all we actually have to do is kill him. After we kill him, we win. Oh look! There he is! Maybe he has an ability to go invisible. I don't know. But, we win. Well, pretty much anyway. Huzzah! Victory is, yours. Victory is ours! So that wasn't too bad at all. We only lost 89 guys. Talabayam lost more. But, these guys, they got thwacked. Now, I believe there's a cutscene after this, so I'm going to shut up and hopefully we can see it. You have won. Have I? Yes. Is the war over? The war is never over. However, this battle is won, and a great enemy has been defeated. Yeah. There will be other battles to be fought, but not for a while. You and your people have earned themselves a little peace. But only a little. What of your people? What of the folk of Ulthuan? We have fought this foe for thousands of years, and we will fight it for thousands more if need be. Yet, while we have allies like you, we will not fight alone. And that is good for all of us. Isn't it? You survived then, Reich's Marshal. <laughs> I survived the great war against chaos. This was no worse. <laughs> I bring word from the Emperor. Magnus sends his congratulations on a great victory. Worthy of a Count of the Empire were his words, I believe. I did what any man... A Count of the Empire, you say? Oh, yes. Yes, Stefan, a Count. <laughs> the Emperor has recognized your claim to the throne of Ostermark. And none of the other electors have objected. You are to travel to Nuln as soon as matters here are resolved for your formal elevation. A finely won victory, Count von Kessel. I told you there was no evil in your heart. It is just a scar and nothing more. There is no mark of chaos upon you. We are learned in many ways of healing. Our kin can remove that for you. No, I shall keep it. As you say, it is just a scar. One of many I now have. Nothing more. Huzzah! But hey, we won. So, that's the Empire campaign over. And I have to say that for all the bugs that this game has, all the really, really, really bad bugs this game has, from cutting out on loading screens to just, you know, units wouldn't even line up in a straight line when they were standing next to each other a couple of times that you saw there. 
but for all its bugs, it's not a bad game. And I think part of that is because there are very few Warhammer games. There's many... There, well, there's Dawn of War. But that's not Warhammer, that's Warhammer 40,000. Which is a very, very different universe. But... It's an, it's an interesting game because it sort of blends together the Rome Total War experience along with the Company of Heroes experience. Where you have to order your units around and each campaign, it's, it's overarching, but you move on a campaign map. It sort of it tried to blend them together, I think. It didn't do so well, all in all, but it's not a bad game. It just wasn't a polished game. But I did like that the story basically revolved around Stefan attempting to earn redemption for something that he had not done. He was branded with the Mark of Chaos because of something his father and grandfather allegedly did, not something that Stefan had done. So it's interesting that he feels he has to redeem himself for actions that he's never taken. And you can see that throughout the game where he's very self-depreciating and he's very vigilant against chaos. At the very mention of it, he's, he's up in arms. He decides, no, we must fight that. We must kill it. He's very much like Brother Gunther in his hatred. In that it fuels him towards acts of greatness. But it's an interesting story that his redemption leads to him becoming one of the most powerful men in the Empire. Because there are only 12 elector counts. There's, a, there's 15 electors, I believe, because the priests of Ulrich and Sigma have one as well, and the halflings have an elector too. Yeah, don't, don't even ask about the halflings. They're just, they're there. It's totally not the Shire, it's totally not ripped off of Tolkien. Nope, 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 nope. Maybe a little. Nope. But it's an interesting story, and I think that they told it well. And the reason that I like this game is that all the actions that take place in here are mirrored in the Hordes of Chaos mission. missions. So you actually kill Prince Kalanos, I believe, in the Chaos campaign, and the final mission is the reverse of the Empire's final mission. So it was it was quite good that your actions did have consequences. In the game, at any rate. But I didn't like how they flooded you with money in the last uh, chapter, because you didn't need it. I was playing it on hard, and you really did not need it. Because I don't think we lost completely a unit after the first chapter? Maybe we did in the second chapter, I can't remember exactly, but we didn't lose many. So it was kind of odd that they flooded you with money, but all in all, it's not a bad game. I might play through the Hordes of Chaos campaign if enough people want to watch that, but that will depend on whether I can be bothered putting in the effort of having to pause and restart recording every five seconds because this and Fraps fight like bitchy girls in a schoolyard. But anyway, I think that will bring this Let's Play to a conclusion. A successful conclusion, which makes me quite happy. And next up is something that you probably won't be expecting. Or maybe you will be expecting it. But it's a mystery until you see it. So, this is Grey Hunter signing out.